Hello everyone, I am back with another video. I know it's been a while since I've sat down and done a chatty tutorial, but I am back. This is my painted leather jacket video and I've done one very similar um, last year, my painted denim jacket. So I'll leave it linked above and below for you if you wanna check that out. So I've painted a few more jackets since then and this is sort of just my updated version. I suppose the biggest difference between these two videos is um, that the fact that it's on leather and um, I am using continuous line art rather than painting the entire back of the jacket. And if you need some continuous line art inspo, I'll leave my Pinterest board linked below. But once you have your design, you just chalk it out on the back as normal. If you were gonna paint the entire back of the leather jacket, I would recommend that you use nail polish remover or acetone. And if you prep the leather jacket with that, it kind of lifts the first layer, like the factory seal off the leather and it helps your paint adhere more to the jacket and it just lasts a bit longer. So once you've chalked out your design, you're going to need your paints. For this, I'm using Jacquard, which is a heavily pigmented, thick fabric paint. And for leather, you need to have quite a thin consistency of paint. So like a thick ink almost. So for that, I'm going to water it down with textile medium. This just kind of helps the paint adhere to the fabric rather than if you were to water it down with water or something else, it might affect the longevity of your paint. So I would recommend getting some textile medium and you want to build it up in as thin layers as possible and make sure each layer is completely dry before you move on to the next one. And the brushes that I use, I always use relatively inexpensive brushes um, as the textile medium has like a gluey like texture. So you're just washing your brushes more, you're kind of harder on them. So I just wouldn't use like really expensive good brushes. And then when you're done at the end, you wanna thermo set your paint with either a hairdryer or a heat gun, or you can reverse the jacket around and iron the reverse side. And that is it for this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. Um, this jacket is actually available from my Etsy shop. I opened an Etsy shop. Um, if you have an Etsy shop, I totally want to hear from you as well um, because I don't know anyone who has an Etsy shop. So comment below if you have one. Um, yeah, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. Bye.